Power off the save unit. Open the connection box for easy access. Plug one end of the cable into the connection box and the other end into the Save Connect module. Power up the Save unit. Let's get started with setting up your device. First, on the home page, locate and press the menu button. From the menu, select the Service option and then enter the service password when prompted. Now, navigate to the second page of the service menu. Select the communication button, then choose WLAN settings and proceed to scan for available networks. At this point, the Save Connect module should already be linked with the saved device. Once you've found your network name, simply tap on it. Next, enter your network password and press OK to confirm. Now, patiently wait for the connection status to change from not connected to connected. The green LED light on the Save Connect module signifies a successful connection to your network. Your unit is now successfully connected to your network. If you've executed all the steps correctly, your Save Connect should display a slow blinking green color. Slowly blinking green light indicates that Save Connect is successfully connected to the cloud. Blinking fast red light indicates that Save Connect is connected to your router but not to the cloud. If you encounter this, please review your home router's firewall settings. Save Connect 2.0 utilizes MQTT port 1883 for outgoing connections, and it should be unblocked. Slowly blinking red light indicates that Save Connect is not connected to your router. In this scenario, the most likely cause is incorrect Wi Fi password or poor Wi Fi quality at the Save Connect module. Please attempt to reconnect with the correct credentials and make sure that the home internet gateway is close enough to the Save Connect module. Congratulations on successfully connecting your Save Connect. Now proceed to download the app and add your unit to your account.